jumping straight into winner's straight action into here. Winners, yeah, and these are two favorites to win the tournament, immediately going at it. And Shen Chang, I gotta say, obviously no uh, no newcomer to Akuma, so there's not gonna be too many surprises. <laughs> yeah, but, uh, no kidding, that was his last character. It was, he's made the switch to the dark side here. Yeah. Um, but huge. I gotta say, I really like the way Infiltration plays Akuma. Uh, and I love the way Shin plays uh, Yun, and yeah. he's actually a Yun player in Third Strike, so he does have a little bit of history with the character, <laughs> if that means anything. I don't, I don't know if I'm going to give him credit for that, okay, but right. we're up. And we're going to see what he's going to do. He's going right in there. Infiltration is so aggressive, but he's, like, he's a walk-forward type of aggressive. I love that. He's got just enough balls to give him a little edge over most Akuma players who are just playing autopilot yeah, mix-ups. For sure. And that's think, why you see him here in the finals. Yeah, I think a lot of... Oh, that was a really nice, nice read. read. I think of a lot of Akuma players rely too much on the vortex. And they don't. They don't play the footsie game and and really explore everything that he has. Oh man, that does a ton of damage. Solid to him. punish, and finally Young getting blown up for that uh, wake up. And he's got him in a corner. This is right where he wants him. Infiltration's got a lot of EX fireball tricks in the corner. He's very comfortable here. And he puts himself in a corner now. We've seen that all weekend. He's uh, total willingness to go right for that cross up. Yeah. Well, the thing about yourself. that cross up is sometimes you land in front, and sometimes you land <laughs> in the back. That's what's so, so dirty about yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. But Shen saw it, and right now he's fighting where he wants. Oh, Still very much in control, and that is trademark infiltration. Yeah. Just walk right up. You're not expecting it, and he closes out round one. And I know Shen's been watching. We probably thought he's going to do the walk-up throw that he does a lot. Oh wow. oh, wow. He gets the trade, and he converts. He's not jumping a lot on, on Shin, too. Counter hit. There's, I was going to say, Shin up. hasn't been any in a lot, but he did that time. Oh, he's in perfect position to punish. Very Power. nice read. Really nice. Oh, and drops he the link. Uppercut. And he's moving around. And there's his EX Fireball. He's been doing that a lot. Jumping EX Fireball early. Even health. Yun's almost got good age in. But Shin will probably try to save it. I can imagine he's not going to want to burn it in this yeah. situation. He wants to hang in there for round three. All right, but he's, he's not working. in great shape. He's more than one combo outside unless he decides to burn it for Ganagian. Well, he probably wants to use EX Lunge. Oh, oh. that's huge. Oh, that's it. Oh! He doesn't block. In there the wasn't face. even a reversal message on the screen, so I don't think he actually tried anything. He, he just didn't got even hit try and get out. Shen, I got to say, is an underrated player in the community. He's yeah. really mentally strong. Uh, but I gotta say, he's wearing a one-piece shirt here today, which I don't think is a pro, a pro move into the finals. <laughs> not a good look. No, that's not. That's not. <laughs> and uh, one thing that we saw earlier in the team tournament when these two played was, and probably why the reason he's hesitant in using full-screen EX lunge punches is because Infiltration was reacting with uppercuts, which is pretty crazy. He's ready for that. Yeah. That lunge punch really does give him so much advantage just in any situation. Yeah. Almost unfair, but as usual, the top player. Oh, he's got him! Oh, he did! <laughs> Is ready for that. Shenmue a dominating lead. Now gonna face the mix up. Oh, oh and he got him, and that's gonna be yeah. it! Oh, total heartbreaker for Shen. We'll see if he can recover from this. Again, very mentally strong player, so I think he's okay, but. But he got hit by an amazing mix up. I don't think anyone's ever seen that one before. And I like this challenge from uh, Shen out of the air. Oh, not safe. Infiltration plays wild. But he's smart. He's, he's calculating. Got just enough guts there to mix it up and yep. really get in those damage. Oh, he got to oh, punch that. He does the EX lunge oh. that time. And this is the follow-up, too. Good pressure in the corner. Nice upkick combo. Now he's get the over. And he throws him out of it. Infiltration not great. Oh, there's this old they trick. Got he got, I can't believe that's still working. It still works. He clowned Choi with that last night Week in the one tournament. Trick. Yeah. Oh, nice. so dirty! So uh, dirty! Yeah. Infiltration played amazing right there. Looking he didn't lose a round. Very strong, and Shen cannot be happy with that start. No. Oh, wow. Infiltration, again, very strong, and he's got just enough of that extra juice to push him over the top of yeah. the uh, Akumas. Obviously, Akuma benefiting from some of the changes here in Arcade Edition. For sure. Uh, right below the top of the top tier, but again, has that advantage of controlling so much of a match with those fireballs. And, you know, once he gets you down, you're in for some of the worst mix-ups in the game, all of which lead into yeah. solid damage. Akuma's really one of those characters where the potential he has is really only limited to the player and where they take him. So you can see it doesn't matter what character you're playing versus. Young could be, you know, like S++++ here, but a Akuma player, if they're good enough and they put the work in, they can make any match look like a winning match. And that really is the thing, I mean, in all this talk about Arcade Edition and tiers and whatnot, at the end of the day, it's the player that's going to win the match. Oh, yeah. I mean, there's been... 
like if you look at kind of like what the matchup charts are, like there's been so much worse in other games, like Chun Li versus Q and stuff like that. And oh, people are like, you know, surprised. And I'm like, this is nothing new. We've had to deal with this before. Yeah, it's back. They got soft in the Super Street Fighter yeah, Four yeah, era. I think so too, man. Everybody's a winner. <laughs>